Okay, here we go again. And I got a nice good fire going here. Let me check that out. <laughs> Alright. Now I've uh, ran my deep my deep fuel reactor for a half an hour. And mowed part of my lawn with it. And then after a half an hour, if you remember how much gas was in it when I started, she's still running. And it hasn't ran any of that gas that I put in there out. It runs nice and smooth, and it, actually it's relatively quiet compared to most lawnmowers. It might sound loud on here, but actually it's pretty good. And as you can see, she only runs off of... Ah! Ah! I'm going to have to fix that. Making the adjustments on it is a little on the hard side. But, a half an hour of running, and she looks fairly good. As you can see, there will be some adjustments that need to be made. Simple adjustments. Yeah, I'll show you. This reactor core gets very hot. No liquid fuel would be able to make it through this reactor core. As you can see, it is, it would vaporize any liquid fuel before, long before it got into the actual intake. If any, I don't think any liquid fuel ever makes it into the fuel line anyway. A half an hour of running. So I'm going to do a few more test runs on it prior to, uh, bringing it up to date with adding HHO to it which I think is going to be a few days down the road yet but this will give you an idea of approximately how far along I've got with this any interested parties can ask any questions you like and I think the hardest part about doing this right is making sure that you don't have any leaks in the system. Once you've uh, beat having any leaks in it, then the system works pretty much as uh, expected to work. The efficiency yet, uh, I don't know, but a half an hour plus uh, all the testing that I've done so far. Let's see if I give you an idea how much is in there now after a half an hour running a regular lawnmower you're gonna run 
at, at least uh, probably uh, eight to ten ounces of gasoline. So I'll have to go back over the tape to see where I was at before uh, I started this one and look at the previous tape. Okay, now <coughs> that's once again. This is Wild Bob, retired UAW, signing out.